Hey guys, how you doing? This is Manga Etc. I'm here today to bring the review for My Hair Academia Manga Chapter 230. I don't think it's going to take too long. So the first thing I want to talk about is Twice Improvements. An improvement that he's made within this chapter. Now, we, it was previously that you know you could only create, I think it was two? But he has massively increased that number. And I know the, um, I think the, was it the chapter that was called Infinite? Oh, there, was, there was the word infinite mentioned somewhere, but later on down the line, if you um, twice makes a, a remark saying, um, I'm going to make 20,000 cracks of it. So we can at least say that he can go into the tens of thousands of how many clones he can now create. And now it was based on something that was flashback to us, shown to us, where we see twice trying to replicate the, um, the bullet that can take away quirks. And now... Uh, I don't think he can do that yet, but I think that that is something that he's going to be able to do down the line, and if so, twice is going to be kind of oh, kind of OP. I mean, like, the whole whatever number of uh, clones he can create, that's cool, because the more clones he makes, the weaker they are, you know, as it was said within this chapter. One, two is weaker than one, so you know. I'm, I'm assuming that cloud is on down. But if we can start replicating stuff he hasn't seen, that we just heard of, that's a bit much. But even t another way for him to get even stronger is if he could strengthen the clones so they last longer, yeah, so it's basically they can last longer, so that way, you know, one will still be stronger than two, but you know, two will be a little bit stronger, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but yeah, that's something that's covered since very um, early in the chapter, and we see twice just massively producing himself so he can help out his friends, and you know, saying like, you know, this power-up has come out of the want and love for his team and just wanted to protect them, and Mr. Compression's like, you know, that that's kind of hero talk, you know? And he's like, no, 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 villains can do that too. But we see all of that. And the majority of the chapter was really just finding out that Dabby, his fight is still continuing with Mr. Iceman, and it's not going his way. Uh, he's starting to feel the drawbacks of using his quirk too much. His body's inflamed, whatever. And we also learn that Mr. Iceman not only can he control the ice, but he can turn water into ice as well. He can control the temperature, so he decreases the temperature for the water, just for freezing that. If he can turn on the temperature and freeze other things, like other liquids, then that'll make him more OP. But if it's strictly water, uh, that's it. Mm, you know, it's good, it's good, it's good. But I'm just saying, I'm just thinking of ways that they can further improve. Um, Improving that quirk if they wanted to, but yeah, so he's not doing up too well right now. Dabby is on the verge of losing, and the chapter ends off really with uh, oh, I forgot his name, the guy who works for all for one. But he wakes up, Mr. Mr. Giga, as I call him, and Mr. Giga's gonna be heading that way soon to help them out. So, you know, that was part of their initial plan to just. Use them to weaken him. So then Shiggy contained the beast. So I'm gonna give this chapter a free story and there was a standard chapter, nothing wrong with it, nothing right with it. I mean standard you know what I'm trying to say here. Like always guys must for your thoughts and opinions. If you haven't already please guys my YouTube channel and most importantly take care, have a nice day.